Hey guys, it's Madison here, and I'm sorry about the like technical difficulties, but today's DIY of the hour is going to be like a light switch cover thing. Alright, so if your light switch is painted, you're going to want to paint it white. When did that get there? I don't even know when that got there. Okay, and then you're going to have to let it dry. So while that's drying, what I've done is cut out a little template thing, which is what I'm going to tape up on my wall and then paint over this and see how it looks to have like a chevron pattern. Don't know what this is. Okay. So while those are drying, while that's drying and y'all are probably cutting this out right now or going to see if you have the stuff to paint it, so you're going to need paper, paint, a paintbrush, and a light socket thing, and a dog. Because dogs are a man's best friend, or a woman. Isn't it Briggs? Yeah. He says, yeah. Okay. So let me talk to y'all what's coming up in the nearby future. Okay. I'm going to be doing makeup videos, DIY back to school series, which most people are already in school, nail art stuff. It's just going to be a different thing every day or every hour for like, I don't know, a day. Okay. And so I think mine might be dry. Yes, it is dry. Okay. So what you want to do is go ahead and tape up your template. I'm going to set you up here and hopefully that you can see me. Hopefully that you can see me. Probably not. Kind of scared to set that up on my window. There you go. I know it's not going to fall now. Still a little bit nervous. Okay, so go ahead and tape up your template once you've got your thing painted. Make sure it's taped good, too. So just tape it up. Tape it up, tape it up. Okay, so... Little crickets? Oh, well. Make sure it stays. And you're going to need two colors of paint for this job. I'm doing pink and, you know, white. And if you didn't want a white background, you could paint the background over over the white. The white was just to like mask the color that was already there. Okay, so I'm going to get you down and show you what I've got. Okay, so this is what I have. And that's probably going to be cut off. But yeah, it's on. Switch off. I creased that, but oh well. Okay, so what you want to do now is go ahead and get the color paint that you want. And I think I'm going to go with blue. This is... Apple Barrels, 2613 Caribbean. I'm pretty sure y'all like, can see that. Yep. Okay. So what I'm going to do is pour it in my paint palette. And if you don't have a paint palette, you could just use a piece of cardboard. 
Doesn't matter. I'm all fancy like that. <laughs> Good. Okay. So just paint now. This is the fun part. And if you want to, you can outline your edges of the thing in tape so you don't get it on your wall. But uh, I can remove that later on after the video. Okay, so I'm gonna, yeah, just paint this. Just paint it real good, man. I'm gonna go ahead and set you back in your little cubby hole. Hoping that you won't fall. And you might have to hold down your template. to paint fast, but it'd be okay if you wanted to, just to make the job a little bit quicker. I say job like you're getting paid for this, but you're not. Be nice though. That's it. Go to school and become an interior designer. Okay. So I'm going to get y'all over here for me to do the unveiling. Okay. So this is my job. Looks a little bit sloppy, but let's see how this goes. And I just broke that, so yeah. Story of my life, right? Just put it in your garbage. Eh? It's garbage in Madison language if you didn't understand that. And who knows, in the future I might even be doing some singing videos. So if you want to just clean this up a little bit. It's not going to hurt anything if you get some paint on your wall because you can always throw it away. I mean, get it off. So yeah, I am super happy with this. Looks awesome. And if you have pictures, add me on Facebook at Madison Hutchison. And this is my completion. My masterpiece. It looks really awesome. I'm like super excited about this. And I will keep it because my school colors are blue and white until I go to Grove next year. So that's what it looks like. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And join me in my next video. Bye.